Hi, I'm KJ. And I'm Rhea. We wanted to talk to you about why it's important that we protect our water sources and use them wisely. You might think that we have a lot of water we can use because the earth is covered with more water than land. But if this bottles all the world's water, then there would only be about this much water we could safely drink right now. Here are some reasons we have limited fresh water. Most water on earth is salt water in the oceans. A lot of our fresh water is frozen in earth polar ice caps. Weather changes and hotter temperatures are causing lakes and rivers to dry up. Sea levels are rising and salt water is flowing to freshwater marshes and rivers. A lot of water is needed to grow and produce food. For example, it takes 137 gallons of water to produce one piece of bread and 53 gallons of water for a glass of milk. Building water treatment plants to clean up water is expensive. Humans waste a lot of water, such as when they leave faucets, running, brushing teeth, washing dishes, washing cars, and bathing pets. Our class did a survey, and two second grade classes used 29,121 gallons of water in one week. You might think that we don't have to worry about water in Triple because we live by Oyster Creek in the Brazos River. This is the water the city of Sherman gets from Oyster Creek. Ew, no one wants to drink that dirty water. Exactly. Our city has to clean it first before we can use it. It looks like this after being cleaned. We're lucky they clean it for us. I know, because there are places in the world that don't even have treatment plants to help them because it costs so much money to build and run them. So people in those areas have to buy bottled water, boil the water to make it safe. Sometimes they have to walk miles to even get water. Some of our cities have to boil water to sometimes when treatment plants break down. People don't realize that our water is being polluted sometimes, too. People pour medicines and chemicals down the drains. They also pour a throw things down the storm and drains in the street. Our city catches some of the storm water to use it for watering in public spaces, but in some areas, the water drains back into our creeks and rivers. Polluted water can hurt wildlife and plants that use it. Hopefully, you are starting to understand why we need to conserve and protect our freshwater sources. Here are some ways everyone can help. Use rain barrels to catch water from gutters, and then water your yard. The city is should go and sells them. Cities can also collect stormwater and use it to water landscape and public spaces. Take shorter showers instead of baths and use water-saving faucets and shower heads. Don't let water when you brush your teeth, wash the car, or wash the dishes. Run the dishwasher only when it is full. Don't pour chemicals or medicine down the drain or down the street. Don't put anything in street storm drains. Calling a pork polluting.